Gypsum Hill Cemetery in Salina, Kansas. It's a rather large cemetery. There's no way I can wander through the whole thing, uh, but we're going to wander around in some of the older parts of the cemetery. It's obviously a cemetery that's still in use today. They are doing internments to this day. And the way you find the oldest part of the cemetery uh, these days is you look for the tallest stones because many, many cemeteries have restrictions on what kind of stone you can place uh, on your plot. For the most part, the more modern day stones are flat or they are uh, like we're ground level flat or they're uh, very obviously uh, a more modern design. So what I look for when I'm in a cemetery like this is I look for the tallest, most ornate stones. And that is generally when you are going to find the oldest ones in the cemetery. So I have driven over to a location that has a lot of ornate, taller stones. As you can see behind me, all these ones. Uh, and we're going to uh, check them out and see what we can find.
I don't have a whole lot of time to wander around this massive cemetery. I've already spent a lot of time here. But then, uh, you know, since recently I've been cleaning stones, uh, thanks to the support of you guys who have subscribed to this channel, uh, I come across some stones like these two that make me really want to stop and clean them because these ones are so overgrown. You can see the growth all over these stones. I can't even read that one. So I think before I leave, I'm going to cut my walk short and come over here and get these ones cleaned up a little bit. <laughs> up my wanderings around this cemetery I could actually stay here for another couple hours and just wander among the stones here uh, there's a lot of old beautiful stones uh, the unfortunate part is a lot of those old beautiful stones are just so covered in growth that it just it's it's a little rough and I could see that if I lived near this cemetery I could spend like every weekend for a year here, cleaning stones and not scratch the surface of the stones that need cleaned. But I think I'm gonna wrap this up, call it, and um, before I leave, um, leave this place a little better than what I found it. So I'm going to uh, get my stone cleaning kit out and 
clean a few of the stones before I leave real fast. And uh, yeah, and then be back on my way. Remember, when you're out and about walking among the stones, be safe, be respectful. And until next time, I'll see you then. Thank you.